Quick overview of last night. AD was caring, Kyle played horrible, Andre played horrible, AC played great, we turned the ball over too much, and the refs were paid off. Bro, we were really in striking distance of that game. Like, AD put the whole team on his back, offensively and defensively, and just carried us to the finish line. And you know what happened? The refs killed the game. The refs were handed money under the table for that game by Portland, maybe by the NBA, because the NBA wants to see the Lakers in the playing tournament. You know what that means? More money. There's something shady going on here because AC got called for a terrible foul last night, went and reviewed it. The replay showed he didn't foul them and the ref still called it a foul. And then the refs give every single call to the Blazers, every single call. It didn't help that our biggest problem with us last night was turning the ball over. We could not pass we, our first quarter was the second worst quarter of the season. The first worst was a couple games ago. The second worst was last night. We turned the ball over. AC looked like he never handled the ball before, but AC also scored a lot last night. He didn't even look like a playmaker. He just looked like a scorer. I was I was blown away. I ain't never seen him score the ball like that. Definitely was a season high last night. He probably hasn't scored like that since the G League. <laughs> but anyways, before we get into the video, check the socials out grinding as always i'm prepared for the playing tournament i am prepared to make all the videos for the playing tournament i already started processing for that last video and after last night's loss when i really thought we should have won like really thought we should have won like if 80 gets a little help we win and the refs aren't paid off we probably be playing that playing tournament so let's get into the video defense to offense kuzma great size that kyle i wish score. you would just attack like that like he thinks he's uh he thinks he's a multi-level scorer like he can just shoot the ball drive and do all that stuff get an off night shooting whatever but when you're having off night just go to the rack to the all-star break over 47 percent i wish kcp wasn't so inconsistent dog but good bucket though good bucket though we'll clap it up for you Give it to AD. He's in where he can do some damage. Good Bro, feet to Drummond. Drummond Throw played that. like absolute dog shit last night. Dude. Like four points and fouled out. Like, bro, you are starting center. Just stay in front of your guy. Get rebounds like you've been doing your whole career. And play a little bit of defense. He can't do any of those. I mean, he got a couple boards. But, like, other than that, dude cannot do anything right. We played our best last night when Anthony Davis was playing the five. Late game. Frank Bagel just said, screw it. I'm done with these centers. AD. You're going, just like last year, you're going to go play the five. You know what it looked like? AD was dealing on offense, and he'd come back on defense and just lock the paint up all by himself. Honestly, I wouldn't be opposed to just playing him at the five now. I really thought it would have been a good idea to give AD some like some less body work and have Dre go take the hits and have Mark go take the hits. And, but no, we need, we need Anthony in the paint, obviously. We'll just get bodied all game until we finally just say, screw it, we just need Anthony Davis. You know, maybe like the one of the best defenders in the league. Let's just let's just keep him in the paint by himself. He should be able to lock up a whole team like he did last night, bro. Like Dre really disappointing. I know Laker Nation's pissed at him. And look, we had great rotations last night, bro. Dude, Mark just keeps proving himself, dog. These games, bro, he's proven himself on why he needs to be in the game, bro. And I'm glad. Gosh, I swear Laker Nation loves Ben Mack. Loves him. Question, is Ben, is ben the best catch and shoot guy we've had on the Lakers in a minute like I really can't think of another guy catch and shoot wise bro let's talk about our guy AD just doing everything from the floor Kuzma's trying to be like AD he's trying to score inside trying to score outside and AD's just like dude I'm just gonna keep doing it there's a minute left and Frank just said you know AD in the paint that's all we need like bro him in the paint by himself he can lock up everyone by himself I forgot how great Anthony Davis was on defense because this is my first time in months seeing this I just needed a little reminder I like how the last highlight was like when we were down we already knew the game was over it was Kyle finally doing something good and playing defense and getting and get to the rack. <sighs> Kyle's so inconsistent, but I feel like the inconsistency is with his shots sometimes. Like, he just takes some, like when I thought he, his shot selection was getting better, it's just, you know, dude, Laker Nation's so funny, dog. I love seeing the comments of people just like, like this, or we love Andre Drummond, we hate Andre Drummond, we love Marcus Saul now, we hate Kyle, trade him. <laughs> I get it, I get it. People are very wishy-washy. I am not that guy. I ride for every single guy that wears the purple and gold. That's what a true fan is, so thanks for watching.